Um, so I was on the L. I was trying to edit it. I do use Google Apps a lot. I like the collaborative thing. I don't know if you, you know, I mean, there are other things, but the Google one is nice. And people could be working on a document at the same time. If you sign in, you get different colors so you would know who's writing what. And I used that at a conference where we had to write a paper and there was like um, an engineer and a couple social scientists. And we were able to write our report. So that's part of Google Apps that you can get for free. Um, what else? Um, I did this presentation in Google, and I like it because um, it's, you know, I can I can take a PowerPoint and I can put it in Google and it's online, and I don't have to worry about that. It can import different formats. So yeah. Now this thing. I'll put my other hat on as a board member for Chicago Instructional Technology Foundation, and we are associated with Mobile Citizen. So normally these these are like um, the hotspot. So you can put it in here, and it will broadcast a network in this room for like eight or nine people. And usually, if you got that from Clear, they're fifty dollars a month a piece. So we give you these hotspots for one hundred and twenty a year if you are a not for profit. And so if you have, some of you have offices where the internet is not good, or you're paying a lot of money right now to Comcast or one of the AT&T, so you could contact us. This, this we're not selling as much, but this actually goes in a computer. Many people's computers now have a wireless if you have an account, so this one is not as good. Um, the desk modem, that would be like if you want to replace the, um, the service in your office, you could have this. But the, uh, the mobile hotspot, my friend Lily had it at South by Southwest. She has an iPad that's only Wi-Fi. So she carries this thing in her purse. And just wherever she is, she stands up, she turns it on, gets a connection, and she can be using her hat. But it, um, one place in Chicago, um, they have students that, one group of students got into a magnet school, but they have to travel like two and a half hours a day on a bus. So they've bought these things for those students. And then when those students are on the bus, the other students would, you know, they would, they would be just advantage. These students can be on the internet their whole bus or their whole L trip. And all you have to do is just contact them. We have a representative in Chicago who will get a hold of you and they'll talk to you. So who do we contact? Mobile citizen. When you look at it, when you look at the site, there's a, this is kind of our generic thing. There's a Chicago branch. So you would go to the Chicago branch, and there's a form on there you fill out, and they'll get a hold of you. Would that work internationally? Call them, what? Would that work internationally? No, it works where there are clear, where there's clear wireless. So in Austin, it works really well. It works in Chicago. It works in New York. Clear is not right now. It's not like a national thing like Verizon. So it works in Philadelphia. It works in Kansas City. But it's particularly nice. I mean, I use it on the L. I mean, I get on a purple line and I come down here and then I just, although I do hear people talking, why does she have her computer on? Oh, she's so great. But I take the purple line so it doesn't stop. <laughs> but I mean, I can't tell you how cool that is to be able to grade all my work and, like, you know, send my emails in the morning before I get to. And um, yeah, you can, there's, if you go to Clear, not to the, to the mobile.